Hey everybody, this is Pam with Trust in Your Process coming to you from my new office. I just moved in here yesterday and I upgraded from my previous office that was around the corner. Same location, just a different office that's bigger. Um, my other office was 4 by 6 This is a 6 by 6 and it's just more room to just spin around in. The other one I felt like I was out in the hallway. And so now I'm setting up to work out of this office, even with my day job. And then in between calls, I could turn around and do some sewing stuff. I just feel like it's just going to be more productive, um, more opportunity to work on my entrepreneur venture, where when I was home in the camper, all I could do is just work. From home, I couldn't sew, I couldn't do anything like that, and so I think this is definitely better. Um, update: I moved out of my apartment last week, Tuesday, a week ago. Um, I'm glad that is behind me. I've closed that chapter. I'm no longer renting two locations. If you follow me, you know I was renting um, or oh, keeping that apartment because my lease didn't end until July 31st. And then I moved into my my RV and my lot. And so I'm glad that's done and over with. Um, what else? I just learned that my check is about to be garnished for a old credit card bill. So if you've ever had that happen, you know how I'm feeling. But I'm letting that go right by me. I'm not even going to focus on it. I'm just going to take care of it. And let them take their money a little bit each month. Um, and I'll just keep on focusing on moving forward. I just got two new clients for my writing. I just decided to get back into my freelance writing as a way to um, supplement my income. And interesting enough, I thought about it, and then all of a sudden, people were hitting me up on my Fiverr account. So that's a good thing. And I'll sit here in between and write and work. And um, I think they have an algorithm or something because all of a sudden I'm getting people hitting me up asking me, what do I charge for blog posts and to write, you know, this or that. So I'm fortunate. I'm grateful for it. Uh, and I feel like I'll be able to do that in this space. Because if I was in my camper, I wouldn't want to work. I would just want to lay up and watch TV. What else did I do with the camper? In the camper, I used the dinette and made and put it down into sofa mode and put nice, you know, put pillows and coverings. And I love that better because now I get up and I um, have my tea in the morning. I journal there and I just sit and I just love that space. It's really important to me that my space is welcoming. Um, and I love that I can separate the space from work. Uh, let's see. I think that's it. Just a short update to let you guys know where I'm at. As you can see, I went back to the wig. I'm kind of getting tired of my shaved sides and my short hair. So I might let it grow back out. Since this is usually my natural length, a little bit longer than this. But um, I said we'll see. But until next time, remember who loves you.